what do you want to kill yourself about sometime? and the armor's on? What about your I don't have any. Besides, I wasn't talking about you anyway. And everybody thinks life's a picnic. Some of us have problems, some of us have sorrows, but people like you are so busy telling us how you feel, you don't even notice the rest of us who are not exactly jumping up and down singing Yankee Doodle Dandy. Hold it, hold it. How are we getting here? I've done nothing but notice you. dragged down to that kind of level. You know, I think you better leave now. You know, I'm sorry. I thought we were kindred spirits. You know what that means, kindred? I know. Two of a kind sharing I know affinity? what kindred means. Then shall we go for affinity? You know, that's the first really rotten thing you've said to me. To make fun of somebody's intellect or education or the lack of. This is somebody I'd be glad not to know. present it to my lady love, whose name happens to be Frankie. And is that not a coincidence? Frankie 
and Johnny. <laughs> okay, uh, Debussy. Hey, Claude Debussy. Claire de Lune. You got this? Why are you doing this? Because everything I want is in this room. Hi, Marla. Um, look, I know you don't take requests, but you think you'd listen for a second? Yeah. Uh, okay, so there's this man and this woman. He's a cook and she's a waitress. They meet and they don't connect. But she noticed him and he could feel it. And then he noticed her. And they both knew what was going to happen. So they make love. And for one whole night, they forget the 10 million things that can make somebody say, I don't love this person. And I don't like this person. And it was perfect. They were perfect. And it's all there was to know about. So, um, I was just uh, wondering if you could play an encore for Frankie and Johnny in hopes that something will last and not, not self-destruct. You think you think about it for uh, a second? You know? 